tidy, and everything is clean, ready for a meal to be served. Caretaker must still set the table. Happy families are all alike. Every unhappy family is unhappy in its own way. Hmm, fire damage. Interesting.
closer. be her. Damn it. You wish to see her? Here she is. A man should frame his wishes carefully. It forestalls disappointment. This some sick joke. Why didn't you tell me she'd anyone buried her? We can't. As for the caretaker, the one you cut down, while still alive, she ordered him to stay away from her for all time. How did she die? Don't see any wounds, evidence of a fight. Her heart burst. Meaning what? A heart attack? No, it simply burst. Find that hard to believe. Yet that's precisely what happened. One day Iris locked the front door, lay down here and died. From grief, from loneliness. The deeper I get into this, the more I gotta wonder. Why are you even helping me? We were summoned to serve Iris von Everick. Our mistress died, but that did not free us from her service. Got it. You wanna leave this place, leave these bodies. <laughs> Surprised? No, not at all. Her ghost's restless, angry, attacks intruders. Know why? Lady Von Everick has endured much hardship. She's unaccustomed to guests and not fond of strange folk. She can't hear us. Seems I gotta speak to Iris's ghost. It's no easy task to contact the mistress. Rage and bitterness fill her. Got my ways. To make contact with Iris, I gotta bury her body. But that caretaker's macabre little cemetery won't do. Too much blood, too much fear. She spent much time in the front garden. Hmm, maybe there. Wait! Take this key. It opens the front door. Good dog. sit here, but this is not a good place for a grave. Too close to the house. I'll keep searching. Destroy them. Hmm. All right. I'll dig the grave somewhere else. Seems suitable. Yes, she loved to paint. Did Iris von Everick have any last requests? Say how she wanted her remains disposed of? She feared death. Worried none would see to her burial or say a kind word in parting. Guess I'll be the one to do that. Thank you. 
I didn't know Iris von Everick, but the paintings here show amply that she and Olgird were a loving couple. Iris must have been happy, once. At times, fate muddles our path, and life turns toilsome, hard to bear, yet all deserve respite and peace and death. You two, got any last words for your mistress? We don't partake in human rituals. Trusting that what you've done is in keeping with your customs. I can't be sure this brush was yours. But if you liked pretty trinkets, you might not mind this one lying at your side. The remains are interred. Let's summon her. Tormented spirit, I've laid your bones to rest. Forget your wrath, forget your grief. Show yourself. Forgive me for tearing you from your realm. I need to ask you. Should I follow you? All right. <laughs> 